Welcome to another episode of Catch You Slipping. Today we are live at Poolsville at the Rigged Fest. You can hear the music in the background. It's all about having fun while learning history. So we're gonna pull up uh, different people and see, you know what I'm saying, what they know about reggae. You know, follow me, let's go. I'm live right here with... Purcell. China. Shannon. Yo, Tammy. Tammy in the building. No. Kennedy. Lou got the fan on me, that don't feel good, you feel me? She said I'm up to no good. But listen, we about to have fun though. The first question is, reggae music was influenced by which earlier Jamaican music genre? Oh, man. That's the wrong. <laughs> <laughs> Hallelujah. Oh, man. What earlier Jamaican music genre? You're making me look stupid now. No, 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 no. I no, would no. say reggae, but I just say which reggae. Yeah, so which I reggae. I don't answer any question. Uh, R&B. So before, before Jamaican, before it was like a genre, like Jamaican genre, what was it called? I don't know. For me, I said Bob Marley. I'm so disappointed in you. Folk music. Mm. No, that's Jamaican. <laughs> fan me. Fan me. Fan me. <laughs> fan me. Aye, aye, aye. Uh, there has to be chance. Wow, I don't know. Oh, African music. Hey! Can you shut up? Nah. Skank. Skank again. Yeah! yeah! She hit it right on that! Yeah, man! Yeah, man! Yeah, man! Rude, man! Alright. So, the next one. Which reggae artist known for his socially conscious lyrics and hits like many rivers to cross? and start in the film, The Harder They Fall. Oh, that was like a famous joint. Oh, that is, um, oh, I see his face. Oh, shit. You know him, The Harder They Fall? Yeah, sure, it's not Gregory, yeah, it's not good there. Nah, 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 nah. No idea. Yeah. When 1990 90s or something? Yeah, the name, the name of the person that started that. Man, yeah, can, yeah, can we phone a friend? Can we phone a friend? friend? <laughs> Man, yeah. That's stupid right now. Right, no, 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 you're not. You're not. You're not. You're not. You're not. I feel good though. Yeah, <laughs> I feel good. Y'all yeah, might have to call my man's right here, man. Oh, <laughs> uh, Jimmy, oh. Uh, Oh, Jimmy Cliff. Jimmy Cliff, let's go! My man hit it right down there, man. Um, Jimmy Cliff? Oh, snap! She is hitting everything on the dot! Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. I mean, you get $20 for the record. $20, sir? That don't sound right. Last one. In which year did Bob Marley perform Africa, Unite in Africa? Whatever year he performed, Africa Unite in Africa. Damn bloody fruit. Say it again. Oh, that was 1974. 1974. We got a nice little one. Probably like 1970. We got a soca. We got a soca. So. Close, close, close. A decade more. Yeah! <laughs> yeah, man. You know what I'm he blessed Africa before he did that, man. Before he left, man. 1980. 1980, yeah! Man, thank you so much, man. Appreciate y'all, man, you know what I'm saying? Thank you so much, man. Peace and love. Africa, unite! Cause I'm moving.